Hi, um, I'd like to just uh, post an update on, well, I suppose it's my first real post of um, an integrated fish, rice and vegetable system that I've been building. Um, it's based on aquaponic system, but what we're going to be doing is using soil, so we're calling it terra, terra aquaponics, terra being earth, aquaponics, terra aquaponics, um, and the idea is to move the nutrient through the system with these ponds which will have tilapia fish, rice, underneath grow beds, and then moving down. As you can see there, from the bell siphon above, um, the cycle is about to come to an end. This continues uh, with timing it about every every 25 minutes 25 to 30 minutes now we're getting a good 15-16 um, minute flush that water is coming let me just move up a terrace so our water is coming falling down I'm going to take you through to the beginning now but here is in our ponds this pond is about 4 meters by 4 meters and there's the water coming in um, and one on this side as well. That moves down that 110 mil pipe and underneath the grow bed, perforated pipe, and then through rock and the stone into the bell site in which you see there. And that keeps the water coming through. That then falls into there, which will move sideways into the grow bed and then down into the ponds below and then we're building our last grow bit at the bottom then the water will then go out. Um, I'm busy installing another another bell siphon there in the corner. I don't know if you can see that. Anyway, that's all happening right now. It is raining, so which has afforded me a chance to quickly take you through this. Up at the top here at our top terrace where we got some we're developing some gardens uh, from the kitchen area. Um, we are going to have our rice, which hopefully is arriving shortly, and the seedling, we make some seedling beds there for the rice. This water comes from this pond, which we just finished recently, which is a duck pond. You can see the little house there. Don't have the ducks yet. It's got a, a slatted base so the guana can fall through. Some fish in there as well, some tilapia. And this water comes from our main pond, which is behind those trees which is about 30 meters by 6 meters wide and is fed by a spring with about 35,000 liters a day. So we're very fortunate to have that. The water comes through, it moves in one direction, is down a stream we've built which goes into the wetlands at the bottom and of course through the system which we're just perfecting all the different levels with. Um, I'm hoping to give updates as we're about to start our soil profiles and stocking of the fish uh, and of course the rice but we're just about there there's still a few niggles we're trying to sort out I look forward to any constructive criticism um, or comments would be great so until the next update which should hopefully be soon take care bye now